So did you used to like to run a lot? Absolutely. Uh, well, I mean, I did PT every day, but I would say that I clocked probably 20, 25 miles a week. I did a lot of running or, or run swim runs. And, you know, I've noticed as of lately that if you told me to go run a half mile, I'd probably uh, look like a, a guy that smoked, you know, two cartons a day. I'd probably pass out. And it's pretty sad. You know, I played soccer my whole life. And since I was a kid, you know, I've been, I got a, running, a runner's body and I have not done any of that in over a year. But what's it feel like on this? Is it close to running to you? Yeah, it's actually uh, just being out here and doing it for a little bit. You know, I can feel it. I can feel it in my muscles, and I can actually, uh, you know, happy to feel the strain in, in my entire leg. You know, usually when I ran, I feel my quads and my, my calves, but in this, I feel quads, calves, and my hamstring, which is, yeah, you no, know, I, I feel good about. How about your upper body? Is it getting a little exercise too? Well, absolutely. I mean, there's always going to be like core stabilization as you shake around in this. I mean, you got your core being stabilized using core mm -hmm. muscles, and then you know, turning and you know, trying to. Maneuver it so there's yeah. definitely upper body's getting it's work out in uh, my chest and my core and then all the way down to my legs. That's cool. So would you like to have one of these? Yeah, I think so. It would uh, definitely get me out and, and exercising again. And I'm pretty excited about that. Yeah. Would you like to like maybe run with your family and stuff, your kids and? Yeah, I would. Uh, yeah, if I could get if I could encourage the wife to get on one, I think we'd have a good time together. Oh, that's fantastic. Hey there, how you doing? Pretty good, how are you? Yeah, I'm doing great. Can you tell me about your bike and yourself a little? Yeah, my name's uh, Thomas Limville and I'm a Marine. It's in Afghanistan and I've been having some trouble doing weight bearing on my right leg. That's why I stepped on an ID and it was uh, damaged in that, that accident. And uh, so I got turned on to this glide cycle and I'm out here testing it out for the first time, seeing how the uh, the offloading of my weight down to uh, less than around 50% uh, affects me and my exercise and how much I can do. And so far, I've uh, got further than I have in the past year. So I'm having a good time being out here exercising and doing it in a relatively pain-free environment. How fast were you going? I think I clocked in about 12.7. Uh, it was the fastest I was, I was going, mm -hmm. which is nice. You know, I'm going to feel the wind in your hair. And, yeah. And, uh, you know, just get out and seeing some scenery rather than being uh, the sedimentary lifestyle I was living previously. Well, why would this be different than a bicycle? Um, a bicycle, I mean, I can get on a bike, but even then, uh, it's not it's not running. I'm not, you know, getting as much exercise, and this actually allows you to uh, get more range of motion than being a, sitting up and down, straight up and down, and just pushing the pedals and going forward. You're actually out here, you know, pushing off with your, your feet on your calf, and and stretching, getting a full uh, range of motion, stretching, working the hamstring and the quads and everything. Yeah. And then um, if your leg gets tired, what do you do? Uh, well, then I'll just rest it here on this wonderful uh, foot bar I have here, and that's what I'm doing right now. It's kind of the end of the day, way past uh, my my time limit, so I'm just out yeah. here exercising one leg and still getting a good workout with one leg. Even even though I have a you know a damaged leg, I can still use the rest of my body. It's uh, still in good shape. So you don't feel like you can get way away from home and not be able to get back or something? No, definitely not. I mean, I'm almost going to push myself to, you know, what I feel comfortable and I'll just turn around and go home. And if my my uh, hurt leg is, is in question, I just rest it up and scoot home with my good leg. Wow, fantastic. Is there anything you'd like to say to any other guys that, um, you know, might be able to use something like this? Uh, you know, it's, 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 it's kind of out of the norm of what we're used to looking at as far as bicycles and things, but, you know, 
people have all been injured and if you want to get back to uh, exercising and doing it without any pain or whatever your issue might be, this is definitely a, so far it seems like a great option to me to uh, get back out and at least exercise and to you know, be able to do something by just training inside all the time. Okay. Well, thanks. Can I see you run away? Sure.